Welcome to this shortwave radio channel and one of the things that I wanted to talk about on the um, SDR side of things and I get this question regularly people asking me you know what is the best software to find receiver software and there are two things that will decide this one is your hardware what you are using as an SDR the other one is your personal preferences because um, this is what it comes down to most of the time when you ask someone why do you like software over another software it's really personal little details so when I get somebody ask me what's the best SDR software I never really answer clearly because I think it's something that is personal and it depends like I said on what you actually use so you know there's software like SDR sharp HD SDR SDR uh, radio.com version 3, Linrad on Linux, GQRX, Cubic SDR on Mac, uh, SDR Uno, uh, you know, there's a lot of stuff. And I'll, I'll share this page actually here, which is an RTL SDR page, where there's a lot of uh, little uh, software and things that they talk about uh, on the different supported software. Now here it's really the list of software that supports RTL SDR.com, but it, there's also other uh, f stuff in there like software for air, uh, you know, air spy, ACRF, uh, SDR play, and, and so on. So I'll, I'll share this actually web page so you can check out the different software. But I think really it all comes down to uh, a personal preference. Uh, my software that I use right now, SDR Uno, is a software that I love and works with SDR play software. Uh, so uh, hardware, sorry. So I have an uh, SDR Play RSP1A, and SDR Uno is made for those uh, devices, and I kind of love it, and, and I want to stay there. I've had different types of uh, SDRs over time, uh, RTL SDRs. I've had uh, you know uh, the uh, Afedri, and so on. And over time, of course, tried different software. The ones I used uh, that I tried actually SDR Sharp. Uh, HD SDR, which was my preferred one on uh, when I was using, uh, you know, uh, SDR hardware. But you got to try it. And of course, your hardware will decide what you can also use because not all software can be used with all devices. Some devices are specific to a, cer a certain software, some devices work with really a lot of different uh, software. So it's really what you use will decide the choice that you have. And in that choice that you have, well, I think that's going to be a personal decision of what you like the most. One little side, SDR Sharp has one thing that not a lot of other software actually has, and it's the ability to have plugins. And there's a lot of plugins that were actually done on SDR Sharp. So for that reason, SDR Sharp might be uh, a special choice for all the plugins available but for the rest I think it's a very personal thing so I'm gonna actually uh, share this page which uh, will show you all the different software and you know you can try these software and see what you think and which one you love the most like I said software is a very personal thing it's the same thing as to why people use Windows or Linux or Mac it's very often a personal preference it often is around what you use and what you do every day. Uh, really very personal. If you enjoy our videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.